Thank you for watching this video on the ICICation YouTube channel. Please feel free to leave comments or to subscribe to this channel. Thank you. There are two types of trains, passenger or freight. A passenger train carries people, a freight train carries freight, which is usually products, materials, or equipment. There are many different types of cars used in a freight train. Each has a general purpose, but can be modified for a specific purpose. We can classify the cars into six primary groups, engine, flat car, gondola or hopper, boxcar, tanker, and caboose. We will discuss each group and its variants in a bit. My display has 20 freight train cars in all. I run it as two trains, each with 10 cars. Each car shows an example of what a real train might carry. A train engine, also called a locomotive, is what powers the train to move. An engine can either pull or push train cars along the track, and multiple engines can be used for long trains. An engineer are the people who drive a train engine. The engineer does not steer the train. Instead, the track guides the train wheels along the route. A Lego train engine can be built with just a few important parts, which can be ordered directly from Lego or purchased from other vendors. We need the following parts. Chassis and wheels, Lego train motor, battery pack or electric track, a remote control, and a receiver. A flat car is basically just a flat steel frame which materials can be loaded onto. Materials are exposed to the weather, such as wind and rain. Materials must be secured to the flat car in order to prevent them from falling off during transport. So there are many types of flat car frames used to help hold a variety of different materials in place. An intermodel car is a flat car which is designed to hold a container or a semi-truck trailer. This allows for fast transfer of materials from water or road transportation systems. A well car is a type of flat car with a lowered middle section with walls, which is called the well. Containers are loaded into the well for transport. A center beam car has a large support beam along the center. Materials are secured to this during transport. A flat car can have many types of frames to secure the materials. Many of my custom train flat cars show an example of material a freight train may carry, although most would be transported in a different way. In real life, people would not be standing on a train car while it is moving. This is very dangerous. Animals would be transported in special cattle cars, which are like box cars with many stalls inside. Steel frames, beams, or cables can be used to secure large materials during transport. Logs or lumber are good examples of this. Small trees or plants would normally be transported in a boxcar to protect them from being damaged by wind. Modern freight trains have special cars to transport vehicles. These are normally enclosed to protect the contents. A gondola is a special type of flat car which has short or tall walls. These are often used to transport gravel, rock, or other bulk material. Content is loaded by dumping it into the car and unloaded by lifting it out or flipping the entire car over. A gondola can be open or covered. Covered gondolas protect the material from wind and rain. A hopper is a type of gondola which has openings in the bottom. 
content is loaded in by dumping it into the car, but it is unloaded by letting it flow out from the holes in the bottom. Sand, grain, or other small material is often transported this way. Hoppers may be covered to protect the material from wind and rain. A box car is an enclosed box-like container. These protect the contents inside from the weather. Products are usually loaded onto pallets for loading to and from a boxcar. Boxcars fitted with refrigeration units can be used to transport cold or frozen products. A tanker car has a large cylinder-like tank on the frame. These typically carry fuel, milk, water, or other liquids or gases. Although a bit unrealistic, my custom train has a transparent water tanker car. Usually tankers are made out of steel and the contents cannot be seen. A caboose is a special car which is used as a traveling house for the train crew and supplies. Modern freight trains rarely use a caboose anymore though.